floor. NASA satellites have been tracking the growth of the oil spill as it, as it has spread towards the northern uh, Gulf Coast. This uh, detailed astronaut photograph uh, provides a different viewing perspective on the event. The image is oblique, meaning that it was taken from a sideways uh, viewing angle from the International Space Station rather than from a straight down uh, view, which is typical of the automatic or automated uh, satellite sensors. The image the view in this image is towards the west. The space station was located over the eastern edge of the Gulf of Mexico when the image was taken. At the top of the image, uh, you can see that it was, it's pointed out the Mississippi River Delta and nearby Louisiana coast. They appear dark in the sun glint that illuminates most of the image. The sun glint is caused by sunlight reflecting off the water surface, much like a mirror directly back towards the astronaut uh, on the space station. The sun glint improves the identification of the oil spill. Oil on the water smooths the surface texture, and the mirror-like reflection of the sun accentuates the difference between the smooth oil-covered water, which is dark to light gray, and the rougher water of the reflective ocean surface, which is colored silver to white. Wind and water current uh, patterns have modified the oil spill's original shape into streamers and elongated masses. And among uh, the coastal ecosystems threatened by the spill are the Chandelier Islands, which are uh, visible on the right side of the view. And uh, TJ, we copied, uh, and uh, we concur, we are still discussing here, so six to seven minutes, that's perfect for us too.